So beautiful. Just like that, that's how we get them in a puddle. Look at that. What we doing? We got palm side. Look at this. Palm side. All right, guys. We hit a spot that was jackpot. I couldn't record it. There's a whole tunnel, puddle full of water. And look at the fact that we want to. Every time I'm logging on, we're gonna see a big difference in that. See all that? This is the haul for the day, guys. It was a banger day, a successful day. It's about to be done and get ready to stir fry with some butter, garlic. Like that. Straight to the pot, onto the table. Me and my daughter, Aviana, right there. <laughs> Good morning, y'all. It's top of the morning. It's like 4 5 in the morning. I don't know if y'all can see my dark self. Oh, there it is. We got light. Me, Captain Rick, and Captain Owen in the back. We are going crawfish hunt. Can't see his ass. It's going to be a banger today, guys. Today, we found out that Crowder is all in the puddle. I want to show you guys how it looked compared to Cage. You guys going to catch a banger today. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Share my videos, family and friend. Thank you to all the new viewers and subscribers. My name is Johnny, if you didn't know. And that is Captain Rick. And that's Captain Owen in the back. And we are going to be heading to the rice field, guys. Thank you. See you guys when we get there. Shoo! Can y'all smell it? Can y'all smell the field? Nah, y'all can't smell what I'm smelling. We are jumping straight to the rice field where there's a lot. The puddle was full. I'm telling you, this is gonna be look, this crawl out right there on the side. Dude, you guys, you guys are in for a banger today. I hope you guys like this. Me. Captain Rick in the passenger side, and we got Captain Owen today too in the driver's side. We got all the captains out today. We're gonna try to fill that bed full of crowd at, guys. Make sure you guys stay tuned. Thank you for watching, guys. Hit that like, comment, subscribe, share my video, show this channel some love. Appreciate the support, guys. Our first stop, we, we're not gonna go to our spot where there's a lot of crowd at. We're gonna check some different spot out right now, do a little homework. And uh, see if there's any crowd out in the field. Oh my God, it came in last night. Oh, look, a lot. Look at the trap, guys. We're at the first trap. Look at this, guys. Look at this. Oh my God, look at this. Big crayfish, guys. Captain Rick at work. Putting the net down. Like that. Trap with this wood. Hello, Rick. Yesterday there was only two, three in there. They came in a lot today. Just like that. That's how you do it. It's gonna be a lot of quiet out here, huh, Rick? Cross this little narrow bridge, guys. Just like this. Don't fall in the water. Fall the water. The two leaves cover. That's me. That's me. That's all our foot from yesterday. Me and look, that's my shoe sprint. Oh, this one got a lot. Oh, Trane. Look at this, guys. Oh my God. Look at this. Look at this. Ooh, that's just one more trap. Almost half a bucket, guys. Shoo! Look at that guy. Get him. There's gonna be a lot right here, Rick. Yeah. We are out on a mission today, guys. You guys are enjoying and tagging along with Captain Rick and Captain Owen. Across the little narrow bridge, just don't fall. Oh, look at that. Oh, one half. One half. Get our shoes in there. So that's how that procedure work. Get to the rice field. Grab the cage, dump the crawl at, and get going, and move to the next. We repeat the process, guys, and we'll do it over and over. So that means in another week right here, the crawl is gonna be stacked straight, straight. Yeah, it's gonna be. We're gonna even check this tunnel right here. Rick could deal with anything in the trap right there. 
Yeah. It's so yeah, yeah, all trap, all along this whole area, and go it's all around. It's a good thing we came here first. Woo. All right, guys. Started off with a banger. On to the next. It's like this. Any product? Oh, there's a lot came in. Might be another one, right? There you go. Look at this, guys. Look at this. Look at this. All stacked up, look. Up, on to the next. See the field? So beautiful, guys. So beautiful. Sunrise, I see that. On to the next. No much? Nothing. All right, nothing on this one empty. So you see how that one was empty? Yeah, sometimes you get them, sometimes you don't. That's how trapping is, that's how it works. Yep, next one, just like this. Huh? Empty. You gotta lift it up. Empty. Nothing on it. No. Huh? Yeah, that one's empty. You can see the case with nothing in there. Huh? That was empty, guys. That one's empty. No, he didn't. Seven. Yeah, that's, that's how we did it. Yeah, that, one, that one's empty, though. He just took everything. Whatever they had. Because they were big. Oh. These guys, look at this. It's just beautiful out here, guys. So beautiful. Same process, guys. I'll get forward to when we get to the pothole for a crawdad. I'm gonna show you those. But right now, we're just gonna do crawl, fish, and trap, and repeating process. I don't think you wanna watch all of it. Skip it to the front. See y'all in a bit. You got two captain in their natural habitat. Captain Vizna Un, Captain Ricky Love. Look at them, look at them. <laughs> Y'all see that? These guys are hard working guys, you know? Show these guys some love, give some respect. Appreciate the hard work to get some food in the stomach, you know? This is what we do and we enjoy doing it. We love doing it. Anything? Yeah, I'm about five. Uh, not bad. Come on, Vizna. Uh, see the see the the merch he got cotton I bought guys, the CMB merch right there. Go chop it. Yeah, these are the pothole we talking about guys. Look at this. There's gonna be a lot of crawdad in here. A lot. I'm talking about a lot. They're gonna be in this water once we jump in. Look, they're already on the rock. You see right here in between. But once we jump in, they're gonna be everywhere. Shoo. Go to the rice field. Tell me. Look at this. Look at this. Bye. Oh my god, they're all on top. Look, they're all coming up right now. Let's go, guys. Look at this old thing. Oh my god, oh this little corner you walk by? Yeah, I think it was a rock 
Yeah, it's gonna get hotter. When it was hot, y'all come out. Sit. Look at that, look at that. Oh, I just thought I saw a lot, man. Shoot, that was good. Phew. Just like that, that's how we get them in a puddle. Look at that. Look how big that one is. Look at that. Palm oh, size, look at this. Palm size crawfish, guys. Palm size. Jeez. Look at this beautiful view. Thank you for watching, guys. Give me the smallness On to the, the tunnel. It's somewhere right there, Rick. I don't know where it's it is. Over here. No, yeah, it's you down there. You can't, it's in the water. You can't feel it. Yeah. It's hella small. Oh, small tunnel? Yeah. Can you feel it? No. Oh, this it, side. Yeah, see? Mm -hmm. Hella crawl that in here, guys. This, this is the puddle we're talking about. Rick gonna chase it all up for you guys. Oh, look, they're all running. Rick, Rick, look, they're all running up. Hey, block the other side. Oh. Go block the other side, John. You can't. They're they they already stuck. Rick, you block them already. Right? Block them already. Get in the bottom of the bucket. Right there. All right. Come on, here, here, here. So these are the puddles they usually by a couple of days, about next week, you're gonna see a thousand of crawl in this puddle. Look, they're all crawling up, Rick, the big one. Look, look over there. Look, 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 look at all the big one up there. Where Ricky's at. I don't know if you guys see that big one crawling. He's taking off, Rick. Get it. Get him, no, he's going to the field. I told you that guy's big, he's going to the field. Huh? I gotta get in there too. I'm enjoying watching you guys. All right, guys, they're getting to work today. I gotta go in there. <laughs> As you guys can see, there's a lot, guys. I gotta get in there to help, guys. Catch on a bit. Pew! These is all what we call jackpot in a couple of days, guys. These little pot right here, right there, right your left hand. These pot holes right here in two days when the water's like five, six inch. Oh my God, guys! You. When we come back in a couple of days, it's gonna be loaded. I'm talking about at least five buckets right here. Loaded a mosquito by my head. Go, Rick. Pick up the net. Show them. That's the net we have blocking the tunnel, so the crowd doesn't get out or get away to the other oh, side no, of yeah. the tunnel. Hey, go dump it. Dump that shit down. Oh, there's a lot of crowd in there. Grab that little net. Scoop it. Yeah. You see the crowd out in there, guys. Oh, there's a lot of crowd out in here on. Rick, there's a lot. Look at this. So now, you can see what I'm doing. They were all trying to go in that tunnel. So that's why we had to block the uh, tunnel with the net. So they don't escape. Because when they hear us coming, they're like, oh, the crowd invader. And they take off. <laughs> they know what we do. <laughs> we here. We know they know we here for them. Mud bug. That's why they call them mud bug guys. This is why they call them mud bugs right here. So mud bugs. Delicious mud bugs though. Look at this. Yeah, the next one. The, th the other one's gonna be hot. The other one's gonna that other one's gonna be stacked. That's the most one I think. Oh no. Those two? They got the most. Yeah, and he's still in there. If I, if I would have, I would not know that they were still in here. Look, they just piling the mud. Oh, shit. I almost missed two, three of them. Right there, guys. Sorry, we got to check it all. Look, another two. Oh. Oh. Shit, I'm just going to this one. Oh, I feel, I feel, guys. I feel clean my hand off. Clean the net. Oh, yeah. All right, on to the next one, guys. All right, guys, we hit a spot that was jackpot. I couldn't record it. There's a whole tunnel, puddle for a crowd. And look at the catch, guys. Look at all that. Look, look at all that, guys. Look at that. That all came 
out of that puddle behind me. See this puddle? See that puddle behind me? That's where it all came out from. A lot of them. And uh, Rick said it's all the crowd over in a little creek too. Let me show you. Uh, he's, in, he's in a little creek, the side of the rice field, saying there's a lot of crowd at. Oh, yeah, look in between the rocks too. They're running. They're not that big. Let's get to the rice field. Come on. Oh, we got to go to the tunnel. Next one. Uh, Captain Vizna is in there. I don't know if you can see it. On the, see, in the rice field, you don't want to destroy it. If you do, just walk the side of the grass, like the side of the grass. It's okay. Just don't go in there and break it down, you know? Puddle like this, they're in, most likely they're in the grass, getting ready to bore a hole and go to hibernation mode for next year. So it's best not to go in the field and destroy the rice field. Just have a little respect. And you'll see crowd and creeks and side of the road. Get those, you know? You always come back and get the other ones later. And uh, that's our catch, guys. Look. Y'all see this? That's our catch right there. Captain Rick and Captain Vizna and City Knight. Look at these them big boys too. Ooh, look how big he is. Look at big boy. Look at that. Ooh, look at this guy. Sheesh, look at that one. All big crowd. I got these all large size, large and medium. Did the men take the back? Uh, I haven't checked. Just a little update guys from earlier. We're just repeating process. Like I said, I've been I've been getting dirty. Couldn't record much, but uh, every time I'm logging on, you're gonna see a big difference in that. See all that? You see all this? Look at that. Jeez. Oh, that's a monster hole. Monster hole, guys. Woo! What a day, guys. Y'all done missed out. I'm sorry. I didn't record nothing. As you can see, look how dirty I am. Look how dirty we all are. We, we're, we're a big mess in the car. Like, we hit jackpot. I'm talking about honey hole. You want to see big, big crawdad, crawfish? I'm going to show you when we get to the house. These are extra large crayfish. I'm talking about palm size, guys. Big red lobster. We got a whole truckload, about almost 25-gallon bucket to eat. I'm talking about almost 20. I do not kid y'all. As soon as we get to the house, I'm going to show you that back of the bed. We're on the road. You're going to be wow by this by this crawfish we just caught guys i'm sorry i said i didn't record it because me captain rick oh we had to jump in there we was like man we was like flash we just we was in quick we was, we never worked so hard before <laughs> anyways catch you guys when we get to the house guys hope you guys like this clip hope you guys enjoyed this video see you guys when we get there this is the haul for the day guys it was a banger day a successful day Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share with your family, your friend. We got a whole truckload. Look at this. A whole truckload. Can y'all see that? Jeez, look at these big boys. Look at these big boys. Y'all see these big boys? Look at all these red bug bugs. Look at that. Look at that. Like, comment, subscribe. All these crawled ass little bugs. Share my videos, guys. Hope you like this content. On to the next. We'll be back again. Shoo! Oh my fatty boy. Ah, he might pinch me. Look at this. Look at these big boys. Look at this. Baby lobsters. These are large size, guys. Large size. And they're medium, large, medium, large. Large, medium, medium, large. Some small ones. Not a bad haul today, guys. Y'all see this. Captain Owen, me and Captain Owen got busy today, and the truckload is gone. But I, we got some to show you guys how big they are. Let me see. Look at this, guys. Look at these lobsters. I'm talking about. Ah! Boy, that dude huge. There's a lot of them this size. Look. Oh my God, boy. Stop. Look how big these guys are. Oh my. Yeah, look at these lobsters. Ooh, cash cookie clean coming up, guys. Stay tuned for that. This is what I'm eating. Oh, look how big uh, these crowd are. It's me, Danny. Uh, uh, yeah, we should have a have bucket for you. If you uh, I'm, I'm not, it's not in my house. It'll be out of my own house. You gotta come over. I'll text you the address. Oh, no, who's that house? I'm friend, friend, the next How long look how fat these boys are. Okay, anyway. Damn, this is. It's for my YouTube! 
Ooh, guys, we're eating good. My daughter's gonna be eating on this big guy. Look at that. Uh, eating that. You wanna fight? You know he's about to die. On oh, him, too. We're about to eat him. He's gonna be delicious. Look at this. Ricky got the fatties, though. Show what he got. Oh, yeah. Oh, bring it on here. Shoot. All righty, there, guys. We're back at the house with the catch. It was a great day, great haul, truck load. And I took a couple here, maybe a couple dozen. Just to make myself a meal for the day. I threw the crawfish in a pot. Already been purged. Look at that. I'm just going to boil until it turns red. Now I'm going to do my typical stir fry, guys. You already know how I do it. If you want to watch me eat, you already know what to do. Till then, guys, we're going to wait till it get bright red. And straight to the fry. Look at that bright red color. She's about to be done. and Get ready to stir fry with some butter garlic let's go finger looking good guys you see all the the reddish color on the outside those little old thing that's coming out that means that the product has klein in Cambodia and it means klein so in english eggs you could say juice you could say crawdad um let me see what you call that eggs and whatever that is correct me if i'm wrong but i don't even know how to say it in Cambodian. all that klein coming out in that water look at that I mean, that crowd has a lot of juice to see the color come out like that in that dirty water, you know? You know, you know. You know, you know. Look at that bright red. Look at this. Look at this. Woo. Delicious, guys. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Share my videos to families and friends if you haven't. My name is Johnny, by the way, guys. Don't forget to hit that like and help the channel grow. With the channel growing, anything can happen. Anything is possible, guys. Here's a little fun fact about crawfish, guys, when you're cooking it. Okay, check this out. When you're cooking a crawfish and you see how his back tail curls up like that, you see how all their tail curls up? They're safe to eat. What I've learned is um, if the crawfish tail is straight while it's fully cooked, I suggest you throw that away and don't eat it, guys. It is, it is a sign of a bad crawdad. So you don't want to get like a stomach flu or you know get sick off of it. I mean nothing, nothing, nothing gonna kill you. Just, just you don't want to get sick. There you go. You just don't want to get sick. So make sure you do when you pick out these crawdads when it is cooked and done. If you see the tail sticking out straight, just throw it away or don't even bother eating it. Just eat the one that has the. You see how the tail curls? That means the crawdad is ready to eat, ready to go. But if it doesn't, it's an unhealthy crawdad. You do not want to consume that. You will get sick. You know, what do I know? Just giving you guys a little heads up. Just a little tips I know. That's about it, you know? Mm, 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 mm. There goes the butter. A whole stick of butter. Well, I don't have that much crawdad. So I don't really got to put that much butter. I got maybe like two, three dozen on. Let that butter sit. You know how that goes. Yeah, yeah. Then I'll drop the garlic. Just like that, guys. The garlics are in. Got the garlic in there with the butter. Let that melt. Let it cook. The steam. See how that steam in there? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Keep in mind, the crowd had already pre cooked. I pre boiled the crowd already before I stir fried it. Rinse it all out, make sure it's nice and red and clean. Drop the crawdad in like that. Crawdad's going in. Just like that. Nothing fancy, guys. Just a pot, crawdad, and butter. Nothing fancy in here. Nothing fancy, alright? It's gonna make a delicious meal. Let's we'll get that butter on top. Let's, let's let that butter soak in that crawfish just like that. There it is. You guys should try this one day, you know? If you're new at cooking crawdad, there you go. You watch my video, give you a little idea. Nothing special about cooking a crawdad. Basic, simple cooking. That's all it is. Got some uh, onion powder. Put it in there like that. That's onion powder, guys. So, here you go. The oyster sauce. Just give it that good. Now, fish sauce. It's up to you. 
You don't have to add fish sauce, but if you want to, you can. I'll dribble a little, just like that. Because I want it to be finger licking good, guys. Mm -hmm. And like that, it's done. Basic cooking. Raw fish. Let it sit in there. Look at that butter. That sauce. And now, we're ready to go on the plate and on the table. Get ready to munch. Stay tuned for that. Thank you guys. Thank you to all the subscribers, the new viewers. Appreciate it a lot. You guys are helping my channel. It's only going to go up from here. Let's keep pushing and keep moving. I do have a lot of fishing video coming up, so stay tuned for those guys. Straight to the pot, onto the table. Me and my daughter Aviana, right there. <laughs> She's ready to enjoy the meal with me. Say hello to you too, guys. This is Aviana, my youngest daughter, guys. Show her some love. Alright, as you can see, we dig in now. It's like this. Look at this, a lot of juice. Mm. Oh, that tastes good. Oh, that's a lot of flavor in that, guys. A lot of flavor in that. Think of this. Look at this, guys. Look at this meat. See that? It's hot. How you feel? Mm, you got a few. Mm, nice job. So, the juice is down here, baby. You can dip it with the juice down there. It's like butter. Mm -hmm. Yeah, guys, we're going to enjoy the meal from here on out. Let me show the meat. Look at this. Look at this meat. Mm -hmm. See that klein? All that klein? Oh yeah, she got here's the head part. There it is. You got the, there's all kind of different ways you can eat the head, guys. Put it with the butter. It's so good. Mm. Oh that butter dip. Mm. Oh yeah. It's like that guys. Can't go wrong. Not even like 20 minutes. Easy crawdat fix. Basic cooking. Nothing fancy. Look at this. Dip that in that saw. Mmm, nah. that busting, that busting, busting. Mm-hmm. Mm. The whole head like that. Mm-hmm. Suck the head juice. Suck the head juice. Yep. Then you put it in there. Throw it in there just like that. When she done sucking it. Yeah. Teaching my daughter how to eat the head juice, what she's getting good at. <clears throat> she's learning. As long as she's she's loving it, she's enjoying it. Mm-hmm. Mm. Yeah, me and her could kill all this in no time. Get that. Mm-hmm. Let me pull another one quick. Yeah, I got you. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Me and my daughter's gonna finish this meal up. I mean, this is about maybe three dozen. Me and her could probably demolish this, guys. Put it in a dip. Mm. See you guys on my next episode. You got a banger dropping soon. Gonna be a lot of fishing after crawdad season, guys. So. So bear with me for my fishing guys. It's crawdad season right now, that's why there's a lot of crawdad drop. Fishing season coming up. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, share my videos to family and friends. And if you guys enjoy this video like this, you know guys, drop a comment. Come on guys. A comment does help my channel grow. Same thing as likes. The bigger the channel grow, the better it's gonna get. Try my best to make the best out of it. Here baby. Alright, there you go. Alright, you got anything to say, Viana? Uh, We're about to go right now. This is busting. Busting. She said it's busting. You heard it from the little one. Catch you guys on my next one. Peace. Shoo! Bye. It's so good.